गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबॉडी आराधना तिवारी फ्रॉम बी टू सी बाई आराधना लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू हैव यू ऑल हेयर इट इज एन एक्साइटिंग क्वेश्चन हेलो टुडे आप फॉर हैविंग टू साइड इन दिस राइट एज पर अदर्स पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू दैट डजंट वर्क फॉर यू आई डू सी इट वाओ हेलो सचिन हेलो मेश हेलो सर सी यू अगेन and then talk is it better now so say yes and if it's better now then i'll talk like this it's very low still very low omg what's going on i'm sure is it better now better okay remove your phones is better now okay great awesome thanks my earphones time for changing earphones <laughs> awesome hey sahasta welcome 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 yeah no it's awesome thanks so much to letting me know thank you so what is it that you guys live with the point of views of others point of view so how much is your parents point of view your teachers point of views your uh, you know friends point of views how much do that matter to your life so it's a society's point of view that everything has to be society you are living in a society you have to work according to them there are norms and rules and regulations and since day one you go to the school to start even before that it's you know a child has to be uh, now crying has now to be crawling should be now eating the food should be now talking should be saying mama papa should be walking should be crawling you know how many shoulds we have living our lives and we have been so entrained with it because not that it's a complaint against anything it's been that how this reality has been working and it's not our um, fault or anybody else's fault of living through that but now what hey vijay good morning so it's now what you have lived you know we get to a space and a room or maybe you go to a hostel maybe you go to a college you adapt the conditions around to be around so what if you actually whatever you learned until today was to adapt but have you not adapted enough now that you can actually choose for you but what happens is we keep keep holding ourselves there back in our childhoods where we actually chose it from the you know we chose what we chose because it that's what worked for us then so what if you start working and choosing and acknowledging that wherever you buying other people's point of views also is also your choice you're buying it because you want to be good you want to be adjusting you should, you want to be seen by them you want to be as normal as them 
and yet at the same time acknowledging that what if you start acknowledging that you are different you can adapt to certain things so it's a lion adapting to a regular jungle activities it's like the lion king movie so how would, so in until when that lion could do that did that but cannot forget its own basic nature hello sora welcome so it's like what for what value are you giving up your basic nature so where have you forgotten that who you be what you be and where would you where you be so if you start acknowledging who you be what you be and and then also not uh, i'm not asking you to go against the uh, you know point of views of the world but what if you start making everything is an interesting point of view what if everything they say and be is an interesting and whatever works for you you take that and live your life from there and choose from there so it's not living from the but how we have this habit of complaining that we chose because this happened to me so and so did this to me that other person did that to me but what if they not did nothing to you you chose out of that because it's the same kid two uh, kids growing up in the same house pick up different energies so is it about the person who's gifting or is it about the person who's actually you know receiving so sachin says wow wait this is being you facilitation yes today i'm in the being you two day adventure class and i i get it it's that facilitation yes and it's opening up so much and i that's my favorite class being you changing the world be the so it's showing up a very different facilitation already so i'm very grateful so wonder what if you do not have to you know there is a demand in my uh, world of not making anybody wrong anymore and not making myself wrong as well your being you class energies are showing up here awesome i'm grateful thank you for receiving them sachin Hey Nitesh, good morning. Ah, uh, sorry, we're saying enjoying it so much. Thank you, sorry, of that really means a lot. Thank you so much. So it's like um. So what if you start demanding that from here onwards, you're not gonna make yourself wrong. You're not gonna make anybody wrong, and no point of you ever wrong. What gift it is, and now you have a choice that you want to take that choice or not. You want to take that point of view or not. nobody is forcing that throttling through your nose and you know we keep being that kid that oh my mom did that to me my dad did that to me my teacher did that to me my friends were mean to me so i am behaving or my you know pa- parents were separated or my parents was abusive but what is the value of you being held there as a child and where would you remind yourself that you're grown up now here what relationships do you require what do you desire truly in your life and you have all the capacities to choose different and it's just a choice away but you have become so comfortable into that zone of crying and sympathy from others and attention from others that you have stopped giving that attention to yourself and remind yourself that you have a choice and you can change it yes that change can be very very uncomfortable but are you willing to be are you not already being uncomfortable with what you're living because you cannot see it so you think you're not uncomfortable but you know it's so many amazing that when you see your friends and i do that all the time and i see other people's life and i okay what is it reflecting about my life here am i doing anything of that sort is that actually what i cannot see about myself and because what you can see in others is also in you if i can bitch about others i am bitching about myself too So if I can see the bitchiness, I do have that bitchiness in me. So what if nothing is ever wrong? What if everything has been a gift and everything has been a choice and nothing has ever happened to you? So for now, which point of view would you be choosing your life from here forward? Great. So everything that is can we let go and change? So again, what have you decided is right as per others' point of view that doesn't work for you? Are you choosing? So what if it's about no more about the right and the wrong? What it's about just the choice, and you know you've been fighting for the rightness of everything. In turn, we are only fighting for the rightness of us choosing that. And every time, guys, that's a that's a um, uh, tool I'm giving you. Every time, you have to say because in your world, guys, you're just compromising there. you are using an excuse and you're not giving excuse to the world guys you're giving that excuse to yourself and stop i would just say stop i just have one word s t o p stop choose different this is one life make the most of it 
enjoy it have that orgasmic living it's so beautiful to live in the world i know it gets temperamental at times i know it gets stuff at times but never give up there's another morning another day every moment we all have each other's back here so you know so much to do in life so that type of a thinking had created emotional stores yes and what's the value vijay so it's like what if you actually let those emotional stores today dissipate from your body why isn't it so easy to accept the way you saying it's it just a choice simran it is nothing is difficult as long as you don't make it difficult but if you are making it difficult then it will be difficult your point of view creates your reality simran choosing the choice that contributes to my happiness yes yes umesh shwa stop yes so whenever you say this you know why can i not why is no question the moment you, you can you see the why you made why is actually the folk and you go back to the same point again and again because you are in that concentric circles of why 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 it happened with me why is it so only happening with me why am i i am such a nice person why is this getting created in my life because you are choosing it if you it's not working leave the space you know what happens is if you are actually disconnecting with somebody if we keep having that chat for a while and we keep talking about it the whole conversation takes a different space but when you're in anger and you're in that space what if you actually just move out of that room and you know you sleep over and sometimes you're really really angry in the night and you sleep over and in the morning you don't have those energies it's so funny at times i sleep and i get up i don't even remember that i fought in the night i'm like why is that the person looking at me like that i i don't remember but if i keep that fight on for four hours and i keep giving answers back in that moment when it's heated up it's never going to end it's only going to go worse so what if you if you're in that uncomfort zone what if you actually step out into a uh, safe zone or in like a quiet zone and go sleep or take a walk don't things change hello ashwini welcome to the space so what one step do you have to choose today to change this in your life it's a choice that you have to make guys and every time you give this point of view as what simran was giving why this happens to me stop again stop Oh, that's a point of view. That's a point of view that it will be difficult. I cannot accept it. Give up that point of view. That's an interesting point of view. That oh wow, I can, it cannot. I cannot accept it. It's tough. That's a very very interesting point of view. Nothing on this planet is tough. Nothing is impossible. Everything is possible. It's just a choice, and that's me. I am like nothing is impossible on the planet. Nothing. Say nothing. It's just a choice I have to make, and I, if I'm choosing it, I'm having it. and that's my demand i'm here to experience life i'm here to have fun i'm here to enjoy every molecule of it and why would i not it's just a choice then you know it's like you know you want to go for a holiday you do everything to do be in to that you know enjoy that holiday how to go where to go and we that's what we were talking in my class right now that if you have that vibrant energy all the time as like going for your favorite thing maybe a movie maybe a holiday whatever what if you can imbibe that energies all the time and when you're not in that energy stop yourself change the point of view move ahead it's that simple and believe me trust me if you believe that what aradhna says and is as simple and it is it is possible it will be possible but if you think that what aradhna is saying is not possible because aradhna's life is easier cool i'm going to have that for myself it's the choice you have to make just choose 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 yes simran just choose 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 awesome that is it so guys and also we have started a morning um uh, my this new morning uh, undefined and formlessness there is a group on facebook fb which i come at in the morning at 9 am every morning and we talk about every day's topic for 15 20 minutes and that's a live with me every morning so this month is the topic is undefined and formlessness so if you want to choose it please get in touch with the team and we that's what we are Uh, creating and there's an few more workshops coming foundation i don't remember my workshops but anyways you can go on my sites and see them if you guys are interested in doing any of them but that's it so but choose ease what if you're the walking talking ease of your life choose ease demand ease in your life guys is that simple you know you just have to demand how is not It reminds me of the joke that I tell all the time. Before I leave, I'll give you that joke that there was a person who 
Uh, this is a Sadaji. I'm sorry. If I'm, I'm a Sadani. So it's okay. You don't have to get into Sadat Sadani. So it's, a, it's just a joke. So take it as a joke, guys. So it's a Sadaji and he employs a manager and he's like, you know, I need a manager who takes care of my everything. What, who to pay salary, what to pay salary, how, how much salary has to be paid. So I want to appoint somebody. And he gives an ad in the newspaper and that, and he, the guy shows up and then he appoints him. He says everything is done, so now you'll be my employee and, you know, uh, take care of everything. And how much is the salary? The salary gets decided, everything is done. So the month gets over and the uh, guy does his job. And then he comes like, oh, how about my salary? Like, who will give? He says, that is not my job. That is what I kept you for. Now you tell me where will your salary come. So it's exactly like the same thing that, you know, you have to appoint somebody that who will give you the awareness rather than you giving so what if you can employ the world for that and choose that easy life and i always remember that sadaji in my head and i'm like i'm having that ease i'd rather employ how to pay your salary is not my point of view the universe has to pay it and let the universe decide so every time i think of like how will this thing show up and then i look at the universe i said employ you pay I do not know how to pay and trust me it works I love that joke of Sadaji it's like he always stays in my head okay life can be that easy so up to you you guys want to make your life easy fun joyful and otherwise you can cry and people who cry will always cry and they love their crying and what you can have sex and joy with crying also and you can have sex and joy with laughing also like me so it's just a choice so make a choice, make a demand, and nothing, nothing in the life is ever, ever, ever impossible. Impossible is the word in the dictionary of fools. That for, that's what I read when I was a little child. So it always stays with me, and I always see spiders. And spiders never give up. So be aware. Awesome. Awesome. Hello, Prakhar. Welcome here. Make the universe our employee. Yeah, employ the universe to give you the ease, the joy, the fun. For me, that is how I do. I give job to things. If the class has to show up, hey, all right. You require me in the class, show up. How about that? You require me to travel to Paris. Paris, do you want me to travel? Okay, call me. So it's like you can employ every and anything for your work. Just life easy. Easy peasy, guys. But you cannot have it. Only Aradhana can have it. <laughs> Just a veggie in your words, guys. Love you all. Thank you for each one from the depth of my heart of for showing up. I'm so, so, so very grateful. And what else is possible? Any other questions before I leave? Anybody has a question? So what point of views are you making so bigger, big and greater than you and choosing on based on other people's point of view? What if you are willing to stand up as you and choosing to stand as you, whosoever you are, whatsoever you are, are you proud of you? Are you willing to have your back? and choosing from the space you know is possible for you because nobody is in you. Nobody can choose from your space because nobody is you. Nobody is a Radna, so you can't choose from my space. I can only advise you. I can only give my point of view. And if you like it, take it. If you don't, let it go. <laughs> cool. All right. So no questions. All right, guys. See you tomorrow, 11-11. Till then, have a beautiful, sexy, awesome, orgasmic day. Bye.